when it got too much for me to handle, then she went into hospital and then care. And it just knocked me for six completely. I just didn't know what to do. We've been used to each other's company all 24 seven for 30 years and then suddenly it's gone. My wife got Alzheimer's four years ago and when I couldn't look after her two years later, I had to get a challenge to refocus my life. And it had to be a challenge that would last some time. The challenge was to climb all the Scottish mountains, which were over 3,000 feet. There's a list of them and they're called Munros. I, I had to find something of this type, otherwise I'd have had mental problems, mental health problems, I know that. And there we are on our wedding day. She's extremely quiet. We never argued. We both liked a very quiet life and that is why we moved north to a remote place in the Highlands. I think this the third mountain I climbed. I just happened to be chatting to other climbers and uh, I just happened to mention what I was doing for this challenge and they couldn't believe it. Climbers just couldn't believe it. They were amazed. Obviously I thought, I've got something here. I'll climb all the Munros, starting as an 80-year-old. And it's been caught on social media. It's attracted social media. I, I didn't realise the potential. And so ever since then, when I see people on the hill, I stop them and have a little conversation with them, tell them what I'm doing. something special about mountains. Uh, ex exactly what it is, I don't know. It's some un undefinable thing about it. Once I arrive, then it's immediate. Any other problems seem to disappear into insignificance. <laughs> Doing this climbing has enabled me to refocus to some extent. <laughs>